It was a PlayStation. It was a PS2 jammed in the dash. <laughs> we got a lot of requests over the past six months or so for the IS-300. We've done IS-300, I think. It's bad. Yeah, it's it's a bad scene, but let's give it a shot. Badass. Banana-na-na. They're bad, man. They're, I know. I They used to, yeah, I used to really want to get one. I like them still, but I good yeah, just can luck. Well, so that's it. Like I used to really want to get one, but then like every time you look at them, like at least in my area, there's only one or two that are available. But like even like we're finding here, all of these are just clapped. I think it's it's about as discouraging as looking for an S13. Uh, right, what do we know about IS 300s? That's worth mentioning. Do they have a one J. They got a one J. One J. Yeah, non non turbo. They have a two J. No, they got them. a two J. Do they? <laughs> mm-hmm. Non turbo though. All right, mute the reach. Neckier, what do you know about ice <laughs> yes. 2J, normally aspirated. They came in sedan and wagon form. The wagon is very rare. I don't think the wagon came in, in manual transmission. I think it was only auto. Yeah, wagon is auto only. I do know that. One. Manual transmissions are, they're pretty rare. I mean, more people order these in automatic. IS-300 is where the term Alteza, head, Alteza taillight excuse me, comes from. Because in Japan, it's called the Alteza. And it started kind of that chrome taillight look. And they're just, dude, Toyota... Knocked it out of the fucking park with the design of this car. They are just very handsome cars, and the styling has really stood the test of time. They're that they're just styling. good looking cars, especially this one. That wagon yeah. is gorgeous. <laughs> it's the Sony Explode Edition the Sport Cross, and this dude's nude. Hell yeah, dude! <laughs> what the? F- it's a, this is in dishes? Florida, bro. It's this, you know. The Sony Explode is well known among the IS-300 enthusiast crowd. Oh, yeah, is okay. It? Sony Corporation owned this vehicle and had it built to showcase their Explode series of audio equipment. The interior had been All completely right. remodeled and the original interior removed. The original interior had been re- has been reinstalled, except for a few modifications that were left, and so on and so forth. He has documentation proving that this was owned by Sony. It was a PlayStation. PlayStation. PS2 jammed in the dash. <laughs> oh, and also... Bro, the, IS, the IS-300s have, like, probably one of the most based gauge clusters ever designed by the Japanese. Yeah, they have, like, it, a it Seiko does, watch nice, for, yeah. uh, for a click for a gauge cluster, yeah. Damn. Owned by Sony and now a nude Flor- Florida man drives this. <laughs> a nude Floridian. <laughs> He's not asking a crazy price. You just get yeah. rid of the get rid of the livery and it's and it's fine. This is really low mileage. It only has eighteen thousand miles on it. That's not a missing digit. It's really like eighteen thousand yeah. on this thing. That's worth buying and repainting. People yeah, are asking that. People costs. are asking that for norm for for two hundred thousand miles sport crosses for ones that Joshua. don't even have a PlayStation in the in dash. the dash. Yeah, you could play Gran Turismo three A spec before the race and crash your car. Trying to talk some shit. Discord.gg slash feed. Let's talk some shit, bitch. I don't care who sent this car to hell. I'm just glad it's there. Collectorcarfeed.com slash store. Limited time only. Here's an 03 IS300 with a wide body kit. Clean title, runs and drives perfectly, super reliable, BC racing coilovers, full Viper alarm system, Apple CarPlay, and, oh, yeah. shit. and he'll trade it for a truck. Also, he'll trade it for a stick shift, so this one's an automatic. That's also, I don't know if you mentioned it when you were going through your IS300 notes, but um, most of these are automatic. Pretty rare to find a stick shift IS300. Yeah. It's not, yeah. I mean, it's, it's, it's uncommon. I, I don't want to say it's rare. You I know, think it's like one in there were, ten. There was like, definitely they're, more they're than three hundred, so it's mass-produced garbage. But <laughs> I mean, it's there's it's, a, there's it's, a pretty good chance one of these will be a stick. Yeah, but it's like going to be one of these. It, yeah, if, if you could, if 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 we're picking one of these random ones you picked, I'm going to put my money that it's automatic. Oh yeah, I would That's say like one money. in ten is a stick. And then one of those 10 will be anything worth looking at. And then one of those 10 will be something you would think would be any reasonable value. 2003 IS 300, 245,000 miles, $22,000. Okay, man, let's, uh, let's see why. It's uh, oh, he's NAT. He's turbocharged it. But... He's, he's, he's turbocharged it. It looks okay from a distance. I, I really do like the Tease. way that the sedans look. They honestly, like, I know the wagons are rare, but like, the Dude, sedans look good. Cars, the sedan man. looks really good. Yeah. They're good looking cars. God, yeah, I don't, I don't hate any of this. Like, it's I hate got, this guy's pants, but that's about it. Yeah, like, I don't fair. like, I don't like the, uh, pants. That's I don't like true. those gauges in the. Oh, time out. Those flip up. That's fucking lit. Oh, that is kind of cool. Huh? 
Yeah. All right. Yeah, because that's where the uh, factory nav would have gone. Kind of cool. I, this is, uh, yeah, this is kind of cool. Like, I don't, I don't hate any of this at all. I just hate that he wants twenty two five for it. And the thing is, it's a quarter million fucking miles. Yeah, yeah. that's it too. Cool car though. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hard to hate. Honestly, yeah. it's pretty cool. It just, yeah, there's just no value there. It's yeah. you know, it's the modded car thing. You've dumped a ton of money into it, made it exactly what you want. Now you got to find someone who also wants exactly that. And wants to pay you a lot of money to do yeah, it. Yeah, so. and and Ugh. if a motherfucker has twenty two thousand five hundred dollars to drop on a toy car, what is stopping this person from taking this twenty two thousand five hundred and building a car exactly how he wants it? Yeah, it's true. You know, you're gonna you're gonna take that money and you're gonna do it where you know exactly what what you're gonna do because that's the best way to do it. You're building how you want it and you're putting the parts you want on it and you know you know what went into it because you touched every bolt. That's the hard thing about selling uh, heavily modified cars like this. And that's yeah. what a lot of like young kids don't understand when we talk shit on them and they're like, "Oh, well, that's so sick, bro. That's fuck, bro. You don't understand. We talk about this around the lunch table all day." <laughs> yeah, you can talk about it around the lunch table all day long, but motherfucker, you don't have the money to buy it. You don't have the money to build it. If you had that money, you'd build it. And that's 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 what it is. You know, there's certain mods that on like certain cars that you just always do those mods because it's like a quality of life mod that everybody does. But then like you get into something like this that like I'm sure some of these mods are like what other similar IS 300s have. But at the same point, the more you do, like we always say mods don't add value, but like the more mods you do, it really narrows down the people that are willing to pay money for this car because they have to have the same taste that you do. Yeah, because to sell a car, you have to get the broadest audience possible. And more people are going to be attracted to a car that has conservative styling. That's how you're going to get the broad market. True. If you fucking stance it, you're guess what? You're only going to get stance idiots. Uh, right. Like you, you're pigeonholing yourself, essentially. Yeah. 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 And you're, I mean, you're, like, you're, I think the 240s will tell you, like, people are going to pay stupid money for a low mile clean one that's stock versus something that's heavily modded. Like, yeah, they might fetch the same money, but... You bought the car, you didn't touch it, or you've poured forty grand into it to, you know, get twenty five out of it. Good job. Yeah, because because if it's a stock untouched car, who's gonna be looking for it? The the purists, the stance. F everyone, literally everyone. Everyone, everyone wants yeah. a stock clean car to build on or just to keep stock. Yeah. This picture reminds me of this picture. That's all. Moving on. <laughs> Here is this. It's an O2 IS 300, 4,500 bucks two days ago. Wow. Tampa, Florida, 200,000 miles, 4,500 OBO. Car is running and driving perfect. Clean title, no rust, on coilovers, needs paint job. <laughs> and no rust no and no stuff. paint. Right, no rust, no paint. Needs paint job, exhaust, alignment, window regulators, and a new AC compressor put in. Already have one, not installed. Running and driving perfect. The hood... The hood actually looks like an abstract painting of Bob Marley. Or Che Guevara. <laughs> yeah. Yes. You're, you're going to be his eyes right here. You got to yep. be high to buy it. There you go. Yeah, but all right. So listen, though. How did all that paint disappear? Like, because that's not just like the sun. clear coat peeling and shit like that. Yeah, like, that's, that's, that's specific. metal. <laughs> that's that's ex-girlfriend damage. It's like aircraft <laughs> remover took off the yeah. paint. Yeah. Oh. That dude pissed off all the pigeons in the area. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. Oh, one is 300 for four thousand dollars. Lithia, Florida, two hundred sixteen thousand miles. Automatic transmission. Four thousand OBO. No financing. Moonroof doesn't work. Interior lights don't work. Keyless entry doesn't work. Check engine light is on. Emissions related. Driver seat damaged. Duct tape covering the tears. Seats quack, will quack. adjust, but plastic parts covering them are damaged or missing. A few Holy dents shit, on the outside. How much for this? 4K Four Four OBO. You know, Fuck you take off what you dude. think it's worth. Aftermarket stereo that sucks. No Apple CarPlay. Uh, radio also <laughs> doesn't cringe. work well. <laughs> Traction I mean, control light is flashing. Heated seat does not work on driver's side. I mean, basically everything is broken on this car. Oh my and God. And it's all it electrical. It's, it's, the it's smaller got, it's some, it has some electrical problems. Some. Some. All of them. Yeah. It looks better than the last one. I got to say. Yeah. I, I I might buy this one before the last one, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here's an O2 IS300 for 5555 five, five, with 266,000 miles. Clean title. Runs amazing. No sticky dash. There's a ghost of a 7 Eleven back there. What, uh, what wheels are those? Spooky. Those are the stock wheels. Are they? 
Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. It just in that one picture with the Ghost 7-Eleven, they did not look like the stock ones. Why did he pull the center caps off of three of them? <laughs> <laughs> pull them off? No, no, sir. They were stolen. <laughs> they just fell off at high speed. Yeah, it's a Lexus. It, it's a Lexus. Somebody stole them, obviously. God, what kind of <laughs> word is this guy with these pants in this picture? <laughs> I'm sorry. It's California. <laughs> he wants to show off his camel toe. 266K on it. Fuck it. Who cares? Dude, they're... And the thing is, all of them are fucking a quarter million miles. That's what yeah. sells dick it's about It's a biases. testament to the 2JZ engine. How about that? Yeah. Do you live in a society, but belong in a society? Do you play bass guitar, but wish you were blasting trumpets? Fear not, rude boy. A benevolent god has created Collector Car Feed, bestowed onto you. At CollectorCarFeed.com, when you search for Facebook Marketplace 350Zs, you get a list of Facebook Marketplace 350Zs. No Altimas, no V6 Mustangs, no Kia Souls. Just exactly the fucking car you fucking wanted to see every fucking time. Thanks to Collector Car Feed, I got my very own 350Z without all the headache of using Facebook Marketplace. I'm blasting trumpets, throwing that sh** sideways, getting doors, and deaf as fuck. The ladies love it too. I'm plowing more beaver than a reckless riverboat captain. Thanks, Collector Car Feed. CollectorCarFeed.com. Lock up your daughters, or they're coming home pregnant. I fucking hate Lexus gold emblems. Yeah, they look God, I, I, so I don't, it, like, it's maybe a little too late to ask, because I'm this far into car culture, but, like, why was the gold emblem there? Like, did it signify anything? Was it just It just option? makes it look fancy, that's all. It's like, oh, look, I'm It was a factory have, option. I you have did. golden emblems, because I'm so rich. Well, not a factory option, <laughs> a dealer option. Ugh. But, yeah, so, so you're already buying the luxury brand, right? And it's the late 90s, early 2000s. You need people to know that this is the luxury Toyota and not just a regular Toyota. Yeah. So you get the gold. Uh, my badges. emblems are actually golden. Yeah. That's how important I am. Back when gold was cool. Yeah. Gold was never cool. Only white gold. We don't like yellow piss here on Collector yeah. Car Feed. <laughs> <laughs> 2002 IS300, $4,050. Two days ago in Livermore, California, 170,000 miles. Has a stereo ready to play music. Interiors 9 what? out of 10 with all black guts leather. A <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> black gut, dude. We got Stephen King writing this description. What the fuck? What? That's how Jesus. fucking Zoomers talk. What the hell does that mean? It means the interior is that idiots. color. That's how, yeah. that's how you know the writer's a fucking idiot. It's like um, about 10 years ago, people would say, like, got the brains blown out, and that meant it was a convertible. What? Yeah, like, uh, it's got Murcielago with the brains blown out. I, uh, you know. No. Um, that's the most cringe shit I ever heard. Definitely Once again, yeah. sounds like a rap song. It's, thing. It's, not, it's not our culture. I don't really follow the LGBT community all that much. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, Feed, you're the only one that has done time, so. <laughs> only in jail never in prison <laughs> he's got tagged up to october 2023 he has his eye on something else and needs to get rid of the car no mechanical issues other than the baby dent on the driver's side door that doesn't affect anything baby the baby dent, dent. like baby the baby dent, dent. Do, 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 that, do. that extends to the to the rear door as well <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice car no it's not, not it, yeah, i one. mean other, other than the dent it's, the it's baby not dent. bad. The baby size it's, den. It's, it's low mileage. Parts. Baby size. It's got the black dent. gut. It's got black gut, and the stereo is ready to play music, which you don't see a lot nowadays in cars. Oh one one is three hundred for four thousand dollars in Winter Springs, Florida. Two hundred fifty-two thousand miles runs and drives great. Brand new battery, alternator, fuel pump, ninety-five percent tread left on the tires. Has a full-size spare, heated seats, ice cold AC, sunroof in great working condition. Oil changed every three thousand miles and no leaks whatsoever. Four K OBO testing the waters. What's out there? No motorcycles, no quads, no dirt bikes. This is the only picture of the car. <laughs> the picture looks like a a scan of a of a. Film picture, photos. yeah, 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 it does. It looks like he's growing plants on the inside of this car based off of the humidity. No, it's it, it was uh, that's the car that they fucked in in Titanic. <laughs> <laughs> this is a champ 2002 IS 300 drift car, 9,500 bucks, 184k. It's actually 10k OBO. It's a factory manual IS 300 drift car. Here's the first factory manual we've seen, and it's fucking trashed. 
Yeah. Driven driven to and from events, has God never damn. given me a problem looking to get into a new chassis, drive it home, or bring a trailer. God, look at that fucking Oh, he stamp. said it. He said the thing. He said he said the name of the movie, dude. Uh, yeah. there was the, the Pee Wee the Pee Wee Herman thing. It's the magic word. <laughs> the angle kit is insane on this. The wheels gotta be stands wheels. way the hell out. They're like arms. Well, it's a shame what happened to this IS-300. Yeah. yeah. If you're looking for a Lexus IS-300, you cannot go wrong checking collectorcarfeed.com slash cars, where we aggregate IS-300 listings and many other neoclassic collector car models from Facebook Marketplace for your browsing pleasure. If you want bonus content or a producer credit like the ones seen on screen right now, check out patreon.com slash collectorcarfeed. Get the Stancy Pants Goes to Hell sticker for a limited time and something like two dozen other designs currently available on collectorcarfeed.com slash store. Free shipping if you spend 20 bucks. Click whatever's on your screen right now to keep watching and we will see you in 2023. Collector Car Feed, your virtual car friends, wishing you a happy new year and closing out 2022 with 11,000 subscribers. Goodbye!